terrifying. Absolutely horrible. Look at the desperation in his eyes. The forced frown lines. The comb over amount of lost hair just from spending his days on Tumblr. And eventually this is what everybody will come to if you're spending your time on Tumblr. How de- <laughs> Literally. It says desperate right there. Spend your days on Tumblr and you'll take a picture of yourself at the end of the day of sleeping in bed. You'll be scared and crying, feeling alone and hopeless and completely desperate. But remember, you're not ashamed of it. Because all of your problems, you have to blame on someone else. Which applies to a lot of Tumblr, believe it or not. Um, like... <laughs> Can you start? Is there a place to start on this? I mean, being obese and taking pride in it is a huge, huge flaw. And you need to grow up and realize women are not supposed to look like that. I mean, objectifying women is how we reproduce and make our, our world into a better place. And I don't, objectifying a woman is not a bad thing. And when you look like a whale, you're not going to succeed in this reproducing. And if you are a whale, you should not reproduce. And you should just take the bullet because please... You are worthless and if you seriously take pride in that, please go now. And that isn't the only thing, is these people wanting to be twinks or these shifty as different sexualities or genders. Why? I mean, and we're supporting this too. I mean, it used to be a mental illness, but, <laughs> and it is a mental illness, but we just come to the, to the point of where we can't fix it that we say it's okay. And we need to just go back to the time of knowing that it is a mental illness and you shouldn't be that way. I mean, pink triangle. These people who SJWs, why you bullied me, these trigger warnings of consexual sex, anti-gay, anti-trans, dirt, needles, spiders, insects, buttons. What should we do to fix this? I, I have the solution. Um, make it big building for everybody who's ever been on Tumblr. People who will eventually end up like this. And just sign them up for death row. And in the end, their parents will be thanking me because hopefully they'll realize that their parenting has made this generation turned into a huge hellhole of Tumblr crybabies. And maybe next time we can be better. I mean, you see what China's doing? They're clearly right with their babies. And killing off all these Tumblr babies would help so much. I mean, why hasn't this been considered before? I have no idea. But listen.